Hey, it's Kaylin from Travel Yourself, and I'm in Reggio Emilia, Italy, at the Venturi Baldini Vineyards, where I'm tasting a lot of delicious wine and even picking some grapes. Cheers! Travel Yourself. So we're going to show you our um, Acetai, which goes back to the 17th century. Um, we do a tasting of our Aceto Barsamico. We'll have uh, the harvest experience and then uh, we'll have a lunch and a wine tasting prepared for you all down here. We are in the balsamic vinegar attic for Vinturini Baldini and it smells amazing. These barrels are hundreds of years old and it takes at least 12 years to make a first batch of balsamic vinegar. Every five barrel is called batteria. And uh, as you can see, uh, the batteria is, is composed by five barrels of uh, five different sizes. So from the biggest one to the smallest one. The smallest one is called Regina, so it's the queen. And uh, only from the Regina, we will have our final product. Uh, from what we start? We start from the Mosto. So, and this is a very important thing because Mosto is uh, the liquid obtained after the pressure of the grape. And uh, from <coughs> the Mosto, uh, we obtain two different very important products, the wine and the vinegar. So we take our Mosto and uh, we cook for two days, direct fire, 80 degrees. At the end of this uh, of these two days, we're gonna obtain a dark cooked mosto, and uh, we're gonna fill our batteria, thinking that uh, this batteria is completely new. So we're gonna fill the batteria, and uh, we're gonna wait one year. So this is what we do actually: wait, be patient, and wait time. After one year, uh, we ex we expect to to lose the ten percent of the liquid that we put inside. And at that moment, we're gonna do what is called rabocco. So rabocco, what it means? It means that, starting from here, I take the 10% and I put inside the regina. I take the 20 from this one and I put here. The, the 30 and I put here and the 30% and I put in this one. So I will have the first barrel, 50 full and 50 empty. So what I'm, what I'm gonna, how I'm gonna fill again the first barrel with the new Mosto, but only this one. So, and this is what will happen every year, one times per year. So as you can imagine, um, what is really important in the process of the, gin, of the mm, vinegar is uh, patience and the time, basically. Um, the rest, is the wood that works on uh, to make the vinegar precious at the end. Uh, here in Reggio Emilia, uh, the minimum age uh, to obtain a balsamico tradizionale, so a balsamic traditional vinegar, is 12 years. So we have the 12, the 20, the 25 years old, and also the 40. Oh. Can we buy some? <laughs> White balsamic vinegar. So good. Rose balsamic vinegar. Ooh, very good. <laughs> Eight year old aged balsamic. But we're going to eat this with Parmesan Reggiano. Pearls of balsamic vinegar. For me, the best way. 25-year-old balsamic vinegar. So good. With his help, we're gonna start to do the harvest. 
Thank you. Time to harvest some grapes. We are now here at Vinciri Baldini harvesting grapes. Oh, wasting time Come with me. Yeah. We have our snippers. Sorry, I have to. We have the <laughs> 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 So cool. <laughs> And the mosto stay here until two months and a half. After two months and a half, we move again the mosto. This lake for us is very important because it means that we don't have to buy water outside. So we have um, for, for the irrigation, basically. So for, for that is very important. We start with the first wine. The first wine is a 100% Lambrusco. It's made with two types of grapes. There is a 50% of Grasparossa and a 50% of Sorbara. Um, we are able to obtain this color that I think is a very elegant color, a very light pink, because uh, we leave uh, the red skin like in during the fermentation only for like one day not even one day we are taste testing a bunch of their delicious wines including this lovely lambrusco which is a red wine with bubbles served cold Yum. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button.